Hello everybody, I'm Mr. Palmer, and this is the Fuck Child Support Media Show. And what I want to talk to you today is about a man who got a letter that he owed $18,000 in the state of Ohio for child support. But you want to hear the funny part? It's for a baby who's been deceased for over 30 years, back in 1981, who was murdered by the baby mama terrorist and her brother. So I'm gonna let you watch this clip and I'll get back to you with my thoughts and opinions. Job and Family Services says it never received any notice that Tanya died. Officials there say notices were sent to her father in the past, but Tanya's father says he never got the letters and the bill is bringing up painful memories. James Cowboy Jennings has piles of paperwork from the Ohio Child Support Office. The state wants money to the tune of $18,000 and has started taking it from his Social Security checks. They said it's for a baby, your baby, which was my baby. Actually, that was Tanya Hogan, and the brother murdered her in Winton Terrace. The paperwork claims Jennings still owes support for Tanya, but Tanya was killed in 1981 on Winesti when she was only three years old. This is where Tanya Hogan's unmarked grave is at Spring Grove Cemetery. Her father says to this day it still brings back painful memories to speak about his daughter. That's why when I got this, it just riled me back. It brought the drag and back up out of cowboy. Newspaper articles explain how Robert Hurd beat Tanya because Tanya wet her pants. Hurd was the boyfriend of Tanya's mother. He struck my baby in the face. Hamilton County Job and Family Services says the Jennings situation is rare. We're hearing from someone that the, um, the child may have died at an early age. Unfortunately, our records don't show that. Our norm, normal social security matches don't show that. We sent him notices over the years on this and uh, they, were e they either went undelivered or unread or uh, were ignored, one or the other. So we went to the Office of Vital Records, finding the death certificate, which proves Tanya was the victim of a homicide. Like I said, this is something we'd asked him to bring in. You've done it for him and uh, we will look into this matter immediately. Jennings says he just wants it all straightened out. They should have examined that and said, where's this baby at? That's all I'm interested in. I can't be held legal for $18,000? Can't do it. Job and Family Services says for now the case is on hold and no more money will come from Jennings checks. There is still a possibility that Jennings could owe more money if the three, for the three years that Tanya lived if he was obligated to pay and didn't. Rob, back to you. Now as you see from the clip in the video, Ohio is, is full of BS. Now not only did you make this man relive his pain of losing his daughter back in 1981, you actually took money out of his Social Security. And it's like from his situation, he's not working a job, he's elderly, and all he got to live by is his uh, Social Security. But you turn around and you take your money out of his pockets, they make ends meet. All because you're about that money. Now, child support is supposed to be for mothers or fathers, single life, uh, not got the, do not have the other parent, to provide. But in this situation, the one who had the baby was a baby mama terrorist. And because of that, should have been with the father. Because of that, the baby lost her life. The baby mama terrorist and her no good brother. So, what I say, the laws need to be changed and stop playing these games. You know darn well that baby was gone back in 1981, three years old. And you come 30 years later, about he owing $18,000. Is y'all in a deficit or something? You want to play a little mind game? That's one of the reasons why I say fuck child support. Because it's a joke. The people that should be on child support is not on child support. The ones who go through it is people like this. So I hope he gets his money back, and I hope he get it with interest. And until they make these changes and stop giving these babies to the baby mama terrorists, this will never stop. So I'll leave you with this. Fix these laws. 
this conversation is over.